happened. And sorry about that. Yeah. So, Go ahead. yeah, that's pretty much what yeah. happened with the gentleman. But, you know, we eventually got it worked out. We gave him a little bit of a discount. So thank you, Richard, for putting up with us. And we definitely encourage you guys. There's still plenty of time. Last time I was back there, Rob Dew was on the phones. He's Our, killing it. Yeah, he's he's a machine back He loves there. All the product, so he's just giving everybody all the information that they need. But so you said you didn't tell him who you were, and he still recognized that No, no, no. Like, voice? nobody recognized oh, me, which was on. fine. Because I know, you know, I was back there briefly when Biggs was on the phone. And he's like, yeah, this is Joe Biggs, blah, blah, blah. And he's like, <laughs> and, I, and I couldn't hear what the guy was saying, but I could hear Biggs. He's like, yeah, this it's the Joe Biggs. <laughs> <laughs> so... Well, I feel bad. Only one person was excited to talk to me. Everyone else was like, yeah, can I get that uh, X2? <laughs> Just trying to roll those transactions. And that's and fine. They, they need that that's X2. Okay. It's, you that's know? okay. Ain't, ain't nothing wrong with that. Now would probably be a good time to give out the number, guys. Okay, guys. Well, let's go ahead and take some calls before <laughs> we have Joe Biggs come on around 630 or so. And the it, operators are standing by actually there t for the uh, to purchase anything at the money box. Okay, yeah, okay. I'm, I got a little confused there. They're talking to my head. All right, <laughs> so this is for the operators. If you guys want to call in to the InfoWars shop, this is 1 888 253 3139. That is 1 888 253 3139. We may get to some calls a little bit later. Let's go ahead and uh, finish whatever news blitz uh, Leanne McAdoo has for us. Well, I was uh, just also interested in the fact that there's a new study uh, being done linking antidepressants in young people to violence. And, uh, you know, we're, behold, we're all, who, yeah. Who, who would ever think that, the, you know, ma most mass shooters, you know, take antidepressants. Before. Right. And they, they will never try to link those two things together. But, yeah, they're saying, you know, these uh, kids age 15 to 24 are more likely to have violent episodes, depression, suicide, which was actually something uh, when I watched the movie Project 22, which is the crowdsourced movie uh, about tw the 22 veterans committing suicide every day. So mm -hmm. um, two veterans set out across country to do something about it. And it was an excellent movie. I recommend it to everyone, uh, Project 22. But that's something that they were talking about is that you have these veterans and they're young. These are young guys that mm -hmm. come back and they go to the VA and the VA's immediate answer, oh, you're depressed, oh, you can't sleep, oh, you're tired, oh, you're feeling anxiety, here's, here's oh, you need this 10 pill. different kinds of pills to take. Let us know if it works. If it doesn't, bring it back and we'll give you... We'll give you of, something stronger. Somebody in the movie was saying that they were taking like 30 different kinds of pills three times a day. 30 pills. And so this, you know, for like PTSD and all this stuff. I mean, that's just because they got to give you a pill for the nausea. Oh, and then yeah, take like this to counteract the, the other effects of the pill. Yeah. And then so then you it's not a wonder why you have 22 veterans committing suicide every day. When you look at something like this, that it's prone to cause suicide. They actually have to put a black label on it. So, it's yeah, because you see those signs. I don't know if they're all around the country, but I've seen them like it's like what kills our veterans and it's a bunch of bullets. And at the end, it's like this big pill, mm -hmm. you know, and it, that's what's killing mm -hmm. these guys because they it is a very good point. They survive, you know, uh, the car bombs. They survive the suicide attacks and all these other things, the snipers. Then they come home and it's this thing that's in their medical Right. In the medicine closet. Well, they were also saying, I think they get uh, like six months or something. I'm, I'm not sure the training. They get however many months of training to go to war, right? But they don't, they give them three days of assimilating back into the real world, you know? And so here you have these guys who are used, guys and girls that are, you know, used to being uh, with a group and it's like survival mode. They're they have camaraderie and they all have a purpose. They have a team, this and that. And then they come back home and they have all these tools, but they don't know how to use the tools in their tool set. So they're not trained to do anything. You know, how do I, how do I do something if I don't have a gun in my hand, let's say, but they, they're so trained. And so they're being undervalued, underappreciated, underused in our society because they're not, you know, they take this toolkit that they have and just shove it down in the basement and never use it again. Meanwhile, you know, so there's other other means for them to. And I've seen that with college students as well, because you have people, you know, they're 18, 19 years old. They live with mom and dad and they go off to whether it's college or the military. And they're still used to people giving them orders and telling them what to do. Mm -hmm. So then when they get out of college, it's kind of like, what, what, what do I, you know, they don't, right. they're not used to that because they live in the dorm. They have the, you know, the, the RA or whatever. And uh, yeah, so I can definitely. You come, back, you come back here and you're isolated. Yeah. And, and, and then you go back and people are worried about. 
you know, what they're going to wear to the club or this or that. And, and you're thinking there's stuff like real things going on in the world. And you're fighting over, you know, is the dress blue or gold or white That's or whatever. The dumbest thing. I don't even know <laughs> what color that dress was. I just remember and think this like the stupidest story of the year. It went. And in so the year of stupid stories, that's quite the <laughs> statement to yeah. make. Yeah. It would be a good uh, Halloween costume. Oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> so we got about uh, three or so minutes before we go to break. So let's just talk, I guess, briefly. Maybe we can do a quick plug here before we uh, come back with Joe Biggs. Uh, we'll talk about some of the great products over there at the InfoWars shop. The one I take the most regularly is the Oxy Powder. Now, some. It's it's a rather intense experience. I, well, I don't know how much you guys want to know about my oxy powder stories, but <laughs> basically, I found that it works best if you drink it along with some apple cider vinegar, and uh, that clears me pretty much out. You know, I mean, I guess groups can speak to more than I can, but I usually try to wait a few hours after I eat to uh, let it get all down in there and and do its <laughs> magical work to experience the ancient purity of oxy powder. <laughs> Well, I know someone was saying that they did their results were a little iffy, and I think it it also you got to drink a lot of water while you're yes, taking you must this. be hydrated. Got to be hydrated, and also what what you're eating while you're taking it is kind of important because you're obviously not going to want to be eating things that aren't easily digestible by your body because you're then you're just making it harder mm -hmm. for this to work because now it's having to counteract what's what's already in your body plus what you're now putting in. Right. More so. <laughs> now, Leanne, I, I know you've taken some of the products. Uh, what have they done for you? <laughs> Are you talking about the super female? Yeah, it's, it's like a whole other person walked in here after she took that super female. She was, <laughs> she was like floating on air and her hair was done. And she's like, oh, it's like a, a scene out of a out of a commercial. They should have filmed that like the day she walked in after she took that super female. But tell us. No, I was yeah. saying I, I thought it would be funny to do like a funny commercial where I just... I just was like so invigorated. I just felt like like grabbing you and like tossing you around or something because it just made me feel courageous and, you know, very sexy and very confident. But like I said, I, I started taking it right when I broke up with my boyfriend. So, um, I you know, it was a little a little too frisky for a single gal. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, that's that's full disclosure here at the InfoWars <laughs> studio. Maybe more than you ever want to know, or maybe that's just what you need to hear. Hey, maybe that's what I you think. Need. I see Joe Biggs out there. Take five bottles, holding of that a, a rather, <laughs> uh, rather interesting rifle. Roger that. We have a custom one of a kind head down rifle. I'll be in there in a minute to tell you guys all about it. <laughs> all right, that sounds awesome. And if you guys don't get that thing, I probably will. I'll try to find some way to take that thing home with me. HDFirearms.com, some great guys. They gave me a watch, which I had to take off to come do the broadcast, but a lot of love for those guys over there at Head Down. They gave Down. me a bunch of lip gloss. Yes. Yeah, I was like, what? They're like, we got a bunch of stuff for you. Apparently, they sell a bunch of lip gloss. They sell all kinds of stuff. Uh, the uh, biking shit. All right, so stay tuned. We'll be back right after this break with Joe Biggs and more special reports. May even take a few calls before we go on to the debate. They're all having a good time. They're talking to this crazy Texan. Everybody knows Texans are dumb. I rode a horse to you know work this morning. If I didn't have a liberal from New York in the bathroom, I couldn't wipe my ass. That's the work of some dirty low-down devil in Forge.com. I reckon he's probably with Al-Qaeda. InfoWars! InfoWars! I've got to say, guys, you guys are really authentic Texans. You, you got cowboy hats. I mean, George Bush says he's a cowboy, but he says he's afraid of horses. I like George Bush. I thought we should have invaded Iraq. Don't you dare criticize our commander-in-chief, boy. You with Al-Qaeda? I'm go with Al-Qaeda, boy. I'm going to report you, boy. We're going to be asking no questions. Go down, 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 boy. My hat is off to those boys. My hat's off to you, man. My tricorder hat is off to you. Get out of here, boy. No, get out of here. No, please. No, please, sir, please. Let that be listen to you, boy. DNA Force.
force. When cells become toxic, they die early and aging sets in. DNA force. No one has put together a formula that focuses directly on brain health, nerve growth factors, and optimizing your cellular energy at the same time. Just one of the key compounds. BioPQQ is backed by major clinical studies. DNA force. We now have the synergistic solution. Secure your DNA force today at InfoWarsLife.com or call toll-free 888-253-3139. DNA force. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Vote for Jeb, or you're just f***ing stupid. Fool me, we can't get fooled again. The average person's life is filled with unexpected challenges. Unlock the energy it takes to defeat these daily beasts with super male or super female vitality. Specifically designed to assist the body in regulating proper hormone balance to create superior vitality in males and females. Supercharge and conquer your world at InfoWarsLife.com or call 1-88-253-3139. running for president. Everyday Americans need a champion, and I want to be that champion. I'm hitting the road to earn your vote, and I hope you'll join me on this journey. The globalists have controlled the mainstream media for a long time, but now they're expanding and making the weaponization even more vicious and deceptive. All the major networks are state-run. We are partnering this year with the NFL. The NFL has become a political weapon against the Second Amendment and pushes Obamacare. MSNBC tells us that our children belong to the state. We have to break through our kind of private idea that kids belong to their parents or kids belong to their families and recognize that kids belong to whole communities. It is more important than ever to realize that we are not the alternative media. We are the true media. The establishment dinosaur press is dying. We are in an information war, and we are losing that war. Join us at InfoWarsNews.com and PrisonPlanet.tv. Members can share their memberships with up to 11 people. By subscribing, you will literally be buying war bonds in the Info War to expand our operation in the face of the tyrants. Join us at PrisonPlanet.tv. And welcome back to the InfoWars Money Bomb. I'm your host, Jakari Jackson, along with Leanne McAdoo. And now joined in the studio by Joe Biggs and his best friend. <laughs> I don't know if I'm referring to Leanne or the gun. <laughs> but uh, Joe, before we talk about the special announcement that you have uh, possibly coming up in the Money Bomb, let's talk about what's in your lap right now. All right, so this right here, this is a one-of-a-kind custom Triton 10 rifle with a custom Cerakote uh, paint job on here. This is a beautiful rifle. Now, myself and Alex Jones have both signed this, and this is made by, like I said, Head Down Rifles. This is a group of amazing people. Alex is not going to put his name behind something if he doesn't believe in it. These guys are one of a kind, just like this rifle. I've flown out there. I met them. Great people. Yeah, they're this good is American-made. So this is the thing. It is, well, technically, we'll say it starts now or at 6.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. From here on out, anyone who donates $1,000, your name will be put into a hat. And tomorrow we will draw the name of the lucky person who gets this. Now, you're not only going to be getting this. I wasn't able to get the site in time. But there will be an optics that comes with this by Georgia Optics. Now, these are the guys who uh, supply us with the uh, the sites on the InfoWars mm -hmm. store as well. Uh, with the G-Shock watches and all that. They're also going to be providing two G-Shock watches as well. We'll get pictures of those out later as well. I'll do that during my broadcast later on. But this is it. From here on out, this is the start for the raffle for the custom Triton 10 head down rifle. Like I said, this is a one of a kind. Mold was broken after this. No more will be sold like it. This is the thing. And like I said before, head down sent these rifles out to us a couple months back. Uh, not this one, I, you know, obviously. But we went out and shot them, put them through stress tests. I threw them on the ground, kicked them around in the dirt. Still fired, stable, doesn't wiggle. I mean, amazing rifle. You're not going to get something like this anywhere else. So I hope everyone's amped like I am for this. Woo! Money Bomb 2015. I'm quite 